hands go boom. Oh, oh, okay. Uh, we might need to slowly ease into it. Wait, why did it just catch on fire? Hello, YouTube. Komodo Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of Brick Rigs. And today we are back in some more epic tower survival. What do you think, Dob? Oh. I didn't realize he didn't like this. Huh. So today you're probably looking at this tower and going, Komodo, what in the heck is this thing? Well, this is a tower by MML and it is a train bridge tower or tunnel thingy, my bob. That's really bright. So yeah, we have the uh, possibility of getting killed by the train while in tower survival. So there goes the train under the little tunnel and boom, it pops out the other side. So yeah, we're going to be doing that here today. We've got some other creations we're going to check out. We've got a couple tower destroyers that are gonna probably be the most deadly things that we've ever tried. So if you guys are excited for some more brick rigs on the channel, maybe hit that thumbs up button and uh, comment below. What do you want to see next? So yeah, when I said uh, Bob's gonna die a lot today, like this is gonna be full of death because this is gonna be the easy one. The other ones are gonna be probably near impossible to complete. So, all right, let's go ahead and get into the, I guess the fire starters here. All right, the train is coming, so let's get ready to roll here. So I'm going to go ahead and start activating these. Oh, I forgot. I need to be in God mode for these. Okay, it's fine. <laughs> fine. All right, start burning them. Boom. Oh, geez, these things seem way more active now. Like, I don't remember flying off like that. Okay, <laughs> pause time real quick. Can I activate these and then go to the next one? Does this still detonate them? I don't think it does. Oh, yeah, it kind of does. All right, detonate this one. Okay, and then we'll switch to this one. I didn't know I could do this all at the same time. There we go. <laughs> I like how this seat is like way over here. All right, so we're good. So the tower's on fire, and if it starts to collapse, it might potentially get hit by the train. This is glorious. All right, so let's go up here and go. All right, God mode is off, and the tower is on fire. What do you think, Dob? <laughs> oh boy, I'm gonna leave him up here. By the way, why did the left side not catch on fire? The right side is engulfed in flames right now. I feel like I need to go down that side. This side's not on fire at all. It's not a challenge. All right, you know what? We're going to the fire. It's okay. Let's hope it holds up. Uh, hello, Dob, once again. All right. Oh, boy. So the only thing that's kind of weird about this tower, it is made out of scalables, and I don't typically like to do tower survival with those because they don't break as easy. But this is working. It's kind of really hard to tell where the fire actually is because it's all glass, so wait. Okay, is the stair is this staircase on fire? Yeah, the staircase is indeed on fire. I don't think I wanna go on this one. All right, we do have to go across the other side. Hello, Dob, once again. <laughs> okay, go down here. Where's the train at? Did the building shift? Uh, oh, I see the train. Okay, just hold on, just in case it clips the train. It seems like it's a little crooked now. Uh-oh, uh-oh, okay, the train is... Oh, I think we're good. There it goes. All right, sweet. You know, I was actually kind of hoping it would clip it because I just want to feel what that would uh, be like. So I feel like this first round is going to be baby mode because this was actually really, really easy. We need to step it up here. So let's keep walking. I keep losing track of where the stairs are. Wait, oh, and I can't get through this one. Let's go through this one. The other side of the tower, actually the top's still on fire, but the fire starters down here didn't really do much. And I think it was maybe because I was in pause. Yeah, because all the ones that I detonated while it was paused, none of them are on fire right now. So I guess it's my fault. And we'll walk out here and boom, round one is done. We need to kick this up about 20 notches now. All right, so we're ready for round two. So what I need to do, I need to place this over here. <laughs> Wait, Bob's in a weird pose, isn't he? Wow, that looks very uncomfortable. So this is the fire rain. So we're gonna go over here, we're gonna activate all the normal fire starters, and then we're gonna go back, drop the fire rain on top, and hope that it creates a little bit more of a challenge here. So, here we go. All right, so he's in this. Actually, let's get out, make sure we're in God mode. What is that? Uh, stuff's already exploding in here. No, this is fine. All right, boom. Oh, okay. Nope, Dobbs, uh, he's okay. All right, explode that one, explode that one, and this one, and this one. And I think, oh, here we go. There's another one there. All right, that should be it. Okay, and here comes the fire rain. Let's go ahead and spawn it right here. Pause it. Oh no, <laughs> 
that looks a bit crispy. So we're going to stand right here. God mode is off. Three, two, one, go. Ooh, oh, no, no. Okay, I was too close. I was too close. Hold on, did it? Wait, what? Did the tower not really catch on fire again? Huh. What the heck? Well, that's actually kind of disappointing. I, looks like a part of the tower is broken. Uh, can I get Bob up? All right, well, maybe we need to drop something on it. So we need to get this thing out of shape. That way, maybe we'll have a chance to have a true tower survival in it. We're about to have to go to a normal tower. All right, so we're going to drop something big on it. This is the huge tower destroyer by MML, and, and I like how Bob immediately died there. This is fine. All right, so we're going to spawn this up here. This has got to do the trick, right? So pause it, spawn it. Oh, no. <laughs> Let's get a little bit closer. Uh, perfect. Okay. All right, I don't think Bob's going to survive this. By the way, the train's on the way, too. So, double yay. All right, so out of God mode. And, uh-oh, where is it? Oh, no. Okay, hold on to your butt cheeks. Oh! <laughs> it's not going to happen with this tower. Yeah, the big scalables, when they break, it, it like, takes out the whole floor. So it doesn't have, like, the, uh, the floors falling apart in different sections. The whole floor just goes. All right, folks, I gotta clean up the area here. We gotta go big. So I told you guys there's gonna be a impossible tower survival. So let's go ahead and grab a XFS tower. Uh, we'll go with, hmm. Let's go with this one. This one looks nice and clean. So let's pull this one out. It's 3,000 bricks. Uh, we'll do it right about here. So, MML has created some massive creations for tower survival. So, we're going to go over here and spawn them at the airport and see what they look like. So, we have the biggest pyramid tower destroyer. Okay. I don't... Do I have to do anything here? It says the difficulty is very what the heck. Uh, this is beautiful. Oh, is this the out? Oh, no. So, yeah, I said impossible tower survival. You're going to get it here. Now, if we let it break apart, is that impossible? Does it break apart? Oh, it does. I mean, maybe we should be in god mode, but I almost debate doing it like this. Yeah, this might give us a little bit of time to potentially get out of the tower. All right, so let's just spawn this. What does this look like? Yep, it looks like somebody grabbed one of the Egyptian pyramids and just flipped it upside down and said, good luck, everybody. Uh, let's get a little bit closer. Is that... Uh, let's go a little over to the side. Maybe here. Alright, and a little over. It's kind of hard to center this one. Oh, that looks almost perfect. Yeah, I'm not going to have much time, am I? Look at the shadow that it cast. Oh, no. Okay, maybe we should just do a run and just see what it does first. Alright, here we go. Three, two, one, go. Uh-oh. Uh oh. Oh? Wait. Wait, that's actually kind of incredible. Like, it's not moving so fast that, that I don't think you'd be able to stay on the staircase and get out. Now, it is laggy, but I don't think you're going to avoid this thing lagging. Dude, look at that. Oh, that's so cool. All right. I don't think we're getting out of this, but sure, let's try. All right, so we are going to put it in God mode for this round. So we're going to set it up. That way we have time to run down. So it's fairly high, and I think... Yeah, it looks like it's going to hit it. So we'll have probably maybe five seconds before it hits here. So we are not in god mode. Here we go, people. Three, two, one, go. Oh, jeez. Oh, this is not good. This is not a good idea. Waiting for... Oh, no! Oh! <laughs> Did it take out the whole tower? Wait, if we would have been on the one side, we would have been fine. It hit the side we were on. Dude, look at the damage. Oh, that looks really cool. All right, I have to say I do like this. I like it a whole lot. Um, let's set the tower back up. All right, so we have to set it even higher because we just didn't have enough time there. Uh, let's see. Okay, there's the tower. So let's go. So I'm just kind of eyeballing this. I, I can't guarantee it's going to hit spot on, which I know it's not going to. So let's just hope we're close there. Look like we're close. As long as we're not way off. Eh, that looks pretty close. All right, get here. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, go. Oh, boy. Okay, we have time. All right, can we survive the impact? I don't think we're going to be able to. This is impossible. Oh, we did hit it. Okay, wait. 
What? Oh no, it's still coming down. Look at the floor, it's collapsing. Okay, back up. Let it do its thing. Are you kidding me? We survived? Wow. Okay, it's not gonna come back and hit it again, is it? Hold on, did it stand up? Wait, what? Uh, It looks like it stood itself up. Okay, let's get out. Let's hope there's not too much structural damage. Like we picked the perfect stairwell here. Like, I don't think there's any damage to this one, is there? No, it looks great. You know, I almost think there's a million. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No, the pyramid shifted. No, just what I was saying. That I think we're going to be okay. Hold on. Get in the corner. Get in the corner. Oh, it's so laggy. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. Try to survive. Just ride the building down. Okay. This is going to hurt. And... <gasps> Wait. Did we survive? Hey. Hey, it's pretty good. And we did it. Uh-oh, we're stuck. <laughs> I don't think we're getting out of this part. Hold on, we're at the... Yeah, we're on the ground. Yeah, so the uh, big pyramid decided to shift at the last moment, and it continued to hit the building, and it knocked the corner that we were on off. Did any of the corners survive, like, the stairwells? No. So we were in the only stairwell that actually somewhat made it. Wow, that's impressive. All right, so for our next tower survival creation, MML's been busy creating random Komodo gaming things. So it's the Komodo gaming tower destroyer, which I think it's supposed to act like a big drill, except for it's a burger. So we're gonna cut the tower in half. I don't think, well, I wouldn't say half. We're gonna cut it at the bottom here. I don't even know if this works. I mean, it looks amazing. All right, so it's in God mode, and uh-oh. Uh-oh, this might not be the tower to try this with. Hold on, see if we can get it to go in. Oh, there it goes. Uh, wow, it is a drill. Uh-oh, I think we already collapsed the tower. Oops, we might have used the wrong tower. I think we need something that's a little bit more thick because we cut it right off there. Dude, this might be perfect. All right, let me go grab one more. By the way, I like the way this looks. Uh, look at the inside real quick. Got your controls down here. What's inside of here? Anything? Uh, no. By the way, I think this is also the burger that we used to drop on the towers in uh, previous videos that this person created. All right, we have a big boy of a tower. Let's go ahead and let it start to eat into it. And let's go boom. Oh, oh, okay. All uh, right, we might need to slowly ease into it. Wait. Why did it just catch on fire? Did something just happen? I don't know. All right, so it's going through. Why is random stuff exploding right now? I don't remember this tower having explosives, but okay. All right, so let's go ahead and eat through one more side and then we're gonna let it kind of just do its thing. Uh, okay, and release. All right, so get at the top. Okay, uh, is it still going? Please tell me the burger machine's still going down there. Uh, <laughs> it is. Oh, and it's slowly turning. I think we, it might need a little bit more assistance and we can try to get out of this tower. All right, so we're gonna start it back here. Let's go ahead and hop out, pause it. Now let's go to the top here. There we go. And here comes the burger blade. <laughs> this, is, this is probably the stupidest tower survival we've ever done, but it's great. Oh, oh, the building's shaking. Okay. All right, let's uh, let's get moving here. Ooh, okay, don't fall off there. All right, run. Let's see, get out. Oh, okay, so quite a bit of the tower is now falling down. No, we're good. All right, so follow the stairwell or what's left of it. Okay. Uh, oh, that side's on fire now. Um, Wait, can we get down this? No, the stairwell's completely gone. Wait, what's the burger machine doing? Okay, so it's off. Okay, go down here. Let's see. I think we're going to make it out this. Oh, no. So the stairs are gone. And they're gone below us. Um, Should we make the jump? Okay, you know what? We're going to jump. We're going to risk it for the biscuit. Here we go. Mm. No. Are you serious? And we're dead. Wait, how much of the stair? Yeah, they were gone. <laughs> so... That thing did a lot of damage. It just slowly kind of pulled the tower apart, and I guess it started to collapse. Look at how some of the floor is barely, like, we're hanging on here. Dude, that's actually kind of cool. But there is something, and I, I guess it's in the tower? Or is it in here? Like, how is 
it catching on fire. Like, when we were grinding into it, you could hear the explosions. Wait! Wait, there's little red dots down here. I wonder if the tower itself actually has areas, if it gets hit, it actually bursts into flames. That's so cool looking. <laughs> All right. Well, we've got one more thing we can do with this. So let's go ahead and get the uh, the old burger thing. And of course, you know what we got to do here. We got our buddy Tobias. I'm curious. What does this do to Tobias? This is probably going to be horrible. All right. Almost there. And oh, turn left. And oh, <laughs> actually, it kind of just yeeted him. I was hoping it was going to grind into him a bit more. Uh, maybe we can get it to do that. Here we go. We've got it going in slow-mo now. Let's see what this looks like. Okay. Coming right for him. I think the cheese is going to actually hit him first. Hold on. Oh, it almost hit his crotch. And... Oh! Yeah, he kind of falls. He, he gets hit by it. He doesn't actually get ground up. And he's falling. You know, Tobias, you got it kind of easy today. Uh, how about we just drop you on top of it? How about this? There we go. Oh, yep. And... Oh, there we go. We were hoping for a little bit of Tobias destruction. But anyways, we got some uh, pretty good tower survival in here today. I, I want to eventually revisit a train tower because I feel like that would be amazing. Uh, maybe if you guys have any ideas for that, let me know. Uh, apparently the burger destroyer thing is going to go try to stop the train. That's a thing too. But yeah, thank you guys for all the love and support on this series. And you guys are amazing. And we'll see you guys next time.